Hey guys, welcome back to Vlogus. For reasons that will become apparent later in the video, I am a little behind on the post. But I will try to catch up. I really will try. We'll see. Today I'm heading to Brooklyn, New York via public transportation for a gig. I am shooting a promotional video for a company and need to arrive by 8 o'clock in the morning. Before I, I headed out, I watered my plants and was planning to grab two buses and two trains, but I ended up taking a lift instead of that last bus ride. Just because I'm carrying too many things, it was getting to be too heavy for me. I will explain later in the video that I didn't sleep much the night before. I was so concerned that I would get too tired and I was really concerned about my energy level throughout the day. So when I got to Port Authority, I stopped at Dwayne Reed and I grabbed some lunch for later. I purchased two salads, laughing cow cheese, an ice drink, and some mints. Aside from the shoot, just going to the city is always a big deal, let alone Brooklyn. I have been working at home for a year and a half now, and I rarely go into the city now. So it's always a big deal. It's always like time consuming and overwhelming, and um, I don't always have it in me. Okay, the day is over, the shoot is over, it's 6 p.m. and I'm waiting for the lift ride to the subway station. I'll end up taking this lift ride further out than the, than the one I took this morning so that I can take only one train and one bus home. And you know guys, I felt very accomplished sitting in that lift ride. No, no, I was so tired, I was exhausted. It was such a long day, it was such a long shoot. But I made it, I, I got through it. And I felt good, I felt, you know, accomplished. The cost of that feeling is the pattern that it perpetuates. An unbalanced lifestyle that's really bad. And it's something that I, I really have to get a hold on. Because I really didn't get any sleep last night, it's a miracle how well I'm doing. Living so close to New York, I see the skyline around all the time, but I never get over it. And where I live now, I'm further away, so I don't see it as much. And so it's always rewarding to just sit back and look at it. It felt so nice. It was like a reward after a very long, hard day. All right, now that I'm home, I can go over a little bit about what my day was like today. Today, I went to the city, um, to Brooklyn um, for a gig. I literally left my house today at 6.30, came home, you know, a little before eight. And I am really eating my actual first full meal right now. And this is, a really classic example of my workaholic lifestyle how I physically cannot stop to take a break to eat they didn't force me to keep shooting all day I wanted to shoot to keep shooting all day once I started and also I am only one person so it's hard to get ready and get ready for the next thing because I was shooting things as they were happening it's hard to stop to eat then I also also get ready. So, you know, I felt like sacrifices needed to be made. I'm going to eat because I'm really hungry. I'm going to have some laughing cow cheese. You know, I love this stuff. I'm going to have one or two. 
and then I may come back here. I'm gonna start backing up the footage right now. That's what I'm doing right now. And um, and yeah, I'm just gonna also chill for a quick second. As I eat, I'm gonna watch like some podcasts, something brainless, brainless, something just for a little bit. I won't, it's, it's 8 15 maybe by 8 maybe by 8 30 8 45 the latest i'll come back and start i still want to i still want to um edit and finish editing because i started finish editing video um vlogmas vlogis you know i can't i keep saying vlogmas vlogis day three i was editing it last night until 2 30 in the morning i was you know i was probably i would probably there are two reasons why i stopped because you know i should have stopped at 12 or at 1 when i saw that i wasn't gonna finish but two reasons that i stopped one reason is when i saw it was 2 30 i realized hey i had wanted to wake up at three o'clock for my shoot today guess what I only have 30 minutes <laughs> and I didn't do a whole lot of things that to prepare like the the good the good thing is I had been shooting around the clock for YouTube so things were out things were charged a lot of things were, were going on but I also needed to make mental preparations I needed to go down a series of um checklists there are a few things that I did forget so the second reason why I realized that I needed to stop was along the way, I had deleted half of the audio on the video. And so I would have to go back and redo it. I'm like, that's just a lot of, a lot of work that I really wasn't physically able to do right now because I was, that was that tired. Like I didn't have the mental capacity to keep going. So that's why I slept for about an hour maybe less than that but that is to show you just how bad of a workaholic that i'm talking about the other day i was in a, i was texting co-workers back and forth they reminded me that one day i did a 19 hour shift some things emergency happened 19 hours so i, I this is major work imbalances that i that i'm telling you here major work imbalances to not and and also i'm doing if so i probably would not eat until 10 but to not eat all day like these are the things but that being said today i really enjoyed today i have been working a corporate job for the most part um the last couple of years i never really go out there and shoot and edit and do the job do that on a professional level i've only mostly done it on the side and I really enjoyed it. Like, the thing is, it's not that I was, there, there, yes, there were things that would have happened if I had, you know, you know, I wouldn't have been able to be ready and be focused. Um, but I also wanted to keep shooting. I wanted to keep shooting. So these are things I really have to work, about, work on. I need to really work on boundaries. <laughs> It's not boundaries with people, it's breaking boundaries with myself. Jeez. You know, I'm going to close out here because to be honest, I don't think, <laughs> I don't think there's any more of the day to go over. Um, if there is something that I forgot to mention, I forgot to talk about or wanted to talk about, I'll try to add video for it and maybe I'll come back. What a day. What a day. I'm Lalo and thank you for watching my YouTube video. I make videos on my goals about life, work, my weight loss, and health journey. Subscribe to stay updated when I post a new video.